Palm Pre. After much industry hype and excitement, it finally debuted in Sprint stores across the U.S. over the weekend, only to be superseded a mere couple days later by rival Apple. The one-slotted iPhone killer was silenced by the swarms of eager Apple devotees who made a massive noise around the annual Worldwide Developer Conference in San Francisco. So as Apple announced a brand new shiny successor to the iPhone 3G, creatively called the iPhone 3GS, it pulled the carpet out from under Palm Pre. Many critics say the $199 Palm device is a good try, but it seems it's no real threat to the iPhone. The iPhone 3GS is claimed to be Apple's fastest iPhone ever, but the specs were hush-hush. Well, they were until they were leaked by T-Mobile's Netherlands website, which posted detailed information about the device's processor and RAM, saying the iPhone 3GS has 256 megabytes of RAM and a 600 megahertz processor, compared with the current iPhone 3G's 128 meg of RAM and 412 megahertz processor. There seems to be something of a leakage problem at T-Mobile. This week, their U.S. servers were hacked, compromising confidential documents and valuable programming information. But of course, the company claims that the hacker called Pawn Mobile didn't get any valuable customer information. Well, they would say that, wouldn't they? And this is not the first time the mobile arm of Deutsche Telekom has had a high-profile break-in. In 2004 and 2005, hackers got a hold of the names and social security numbers of some 400 customers as well as internal Secret Service documents.